And I want to talk you through tornado safety. I, North Texas, I know you are so weather savvy, but it has been a little while, right? So let's talk about it uh, for your home. If you want to uh, shelter there, you're going to need a shelter. If if that's the case tomorrow, uh, you want to make sure to get to the ground level or basement. If that's available, that'll be your best bet. But if you don't have a basement, I don't don't fret. You still have options. You want to make sure to find a room as close to the center of your home as possible. A lot of times this will be a bathroom that's in the middle. This will also be maybe a closet or a closet that's underneath a staircase. That's the case in my home. But what you want to do is make sure you can count walls between you and the outside. So here you have one, two, three walls between that closet and the outside. One, two between this one and that ex exterior. So you want to make sure to have that uh, at least two walls between you and the outside. And you also want to make sure you're away from any windows. Uh, this is going to protect you from any possible break in the windows and debris. That is one of the higher causes of, of of injury is flying debris. So definitely want to make sure to have that emergency plan ready. Make sure to talk to your kids, bring them into the conversation, have a way to get alerts. The WFAA app will alert you. You just have to make sure to have the notifications turned on and a NOAA weather radio will also be there in case you happen to run out of uh, battery. Make sure to discuss those safe spots at home. And if you're not at home or you're not planning on being home tomorrow afternoon, make sure to talk about those meeting places, especially with your family. You want to make sure to secure items outside. I'm talking anything that'll blow away. Think chairs, think umbrellas, maybe put them inside. You want to make sure those don't become flying debris for any other uh, neighbor that you do have. And of course, you want to make sure to charge your electronics. That'll be uh, your best bet. That way you can stay informed throughout the entire event. And as always, we've got you covered, so don't worry. Definitely make sure to follow us on social media and of course, stay uh, in check with us at WFAA.com. Come